can finally put the non-conference schedule in the books, but uh, you finished what you wanted to at this three-game homestand, got three wins, and played really well during stretches in that first half. We did. We played uh, after the first five minutes after we got the three-point line under control uh, tonight. Uh, thought we played really well, though. You know, the last 14 minutes or so uh, of the half, and and. Uh, you know, we were led by Travis Munnings. He had his motor running tonight now, and, and uh, it was good to see him. You had talked about trying to find an identity for this basketball team. You're 11 games in now, getting ready to turn the page towards the conference schedule. You have a better feel for your team now. I do. Uh, I think that uh, us deciding, uh, after the Northwestern loss, to be honest with you, uh, to go to a little, a little bigger lineup, uh, and when I say bigger, I mean Sam McDaniel at a at a wing spot instead of a power forward spot. Uh, inserting Brandon Newman, getting him more minutes uh, down down the road here. A taller guard. Uh, we're not as fast moving up and down the floor as maybe we were earlier in the in the year, and so. Uh, we've given up some of that, and maybe even a little three-point shooting. We've given up some of that, but uh, it's made us a better defensive and rebounding team. Now we're not great at it yet, but uh, it's better than it was. A lot better, actually. And now we just got to improve on it daily and and uh, and get better at it. And you know, we think this is now the route that we need to go to be the best we can be. From game one to game 11, Brandon Newman may be as perhaps the most improved player. You've got to like what you're seeing from him. I, I really do. Uh, most improved so far, I would say that. I think, uh, you know, Michael Erdl, uh has been pretty good in preseason. He's been pretty steady, you know, all along. Uh, we need a little more scoring, and, and uh, uh, we need Michael Erdl and, and Jordan Harris to provide a little more scoring for us. That's why Brandon's getting in the mix a little more to get it to him. He's a good passer. Uh, he's getting in better game shape. Uh, I think he's going to play a lot probably in the conference. And uh, and, and really, we're ha I'm kind of happy for him because this is why we brought him here. We were concerned about being short at the point guard, and we wanted a pass first guy. And that's kind of what he is. And it took us a little while to get to him, but 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 he's here now, and he played he played well tonight. You made a point to emphasize going inside more and trying to score more yeah. inside. You did that a little bit better tonight. Are you pleased with the progress you're making in that area? Well, we're, we're making it. We're making some progress. It's, it's not uh, as much as I'd like. Uh, I've said this before, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's not in our kids' nature. We don't have, you know, that aggressive uh, man-child or whatever you want to call in, in there, either low posting or even that that really strong driving guard. You know, it's just kind of not in our nature, uh, personality-wise, with our team. So we're having to make our guys either drive it uh, or pass it, you know, to people cutting or, or in the post to get some plays uh, inside the three-point line. So these two games, we got better at it. Uh, we still need to work on it and, and, and against better competition, but it was certainly a start in the right direction. Finish the non-conference schedule above 500 get ready for conference play. I know that there's an excitement always as you kind of turn the page and that second season really begins. Yes, uh, you know, once the guys come back, uh, we want them to enjoy the next four or five days and uh, we'll be breaking down film with uh, Arkansas State and, and scouting them so that we're ready for when the kids come back because uh, it's always an exciting time. The first conference game, you know, you, you throw away the non-conference records, all the teams do kind of, and it's kind of a start over deal and, and it's always an exciting time and, uh, you know, we're going on the road and uh, against Arkansas State and Arkansas Little Rock, that swing and uh, our guys, I could tell in the locker room when we talked about it, they're excited and ready to go.